The Pittsburgh Steelers just got a major boost when it comes to their free agency situation as the NFL has set their salary cap a whopping $30.6 million higher than it was a year ago, $13 million more than what everybody anticipated. Heading into the offseason, the expected salary cap was looking somewhere around $242.5 million. The NFL has just announced that it will be $255.5 million in 2024. For the Pittsburgh Steelers, what does this mean? Well, with the anticipated salary cap at 242.5, they were looking at roughly four and a half to five million dollars over the salary cap. They needed to clear four and a half million dollars in cap space before they could begin signing other free agents, heading to the NFL draft inking contracts, extensions, whatever you want to say. Now, with the $255.5 million floor, there's $7.5 million under the salary cap, meaning they have $7.5 million in available money to spend in free agency before they continue cutting players or reworking contracts or whatever else they'd like to do. Now, when it comes to creating more money, I anticipate more cuts to come. Larry Ogunjobi, Patrick Peterson, Keanu Neal, Allen Robinson. They have all been named potential cap casualties for the Pittsburgh Steelers. Cam Hayward is set to take on a whopping 20 plus million dollars this season. And I expect that to be changed to a lower number, whether it's a restructure, a, a an extension, void years, however they go about it. I expect a new contract for Cam Hayward. And then you have restructure candidates in Minka Fitzpatrick, TJ Watt, Alex Highsmith, Deontay Johnson, all of these names. The Steelers could come up with plenty of money if they look if they look to. With Allen Robinson, Patrick Peterson, and just the cap casualties alone, they could be looking at upwards of $20, $25 million in available cap space before they even touch a restructured contract. That's a lot of money to spend. Their situation just got a whole lot better. And for anybody sitting around saying, oh, well, what can they do? Can they make some splash? Or anybody who is sitting around thinking about the quarterback situation and what it does for names like Kirk Cousins and potentially a Mason Rudolph deal or a Russell Wilson deal, they now have more money to spend. And unrealistic numbers now become somewhat realistic, somewhat doable. Becomes very interesting. The Pittsburgh Steelers just get a massive boost to their offseason. And the NFL just handed all 32 teams a major favor as they increased the salary cap $30 million.